Assalamu alaikum dear students hope you are feeling hearty welcome to NIEVS home school this is Fatima Sabrin Shikha assistant teacher of English National Ideal English Version School morning shift today I'm going to take computer class for the students of class 3 on the topic chapter 1 I'm repeating our today's topic is chapter 1 and today we will read from page 10 and 11 and after that we will learn some short question and this is lecture number two and today's homework will be number two now students please take your computer book with your writing elements we will read first from chapter one page 10 and 11 and then we'll do short question so let's start chapter one students go to page number 10 here we will learn about desktop computer laptop computer pumped up computer i'll start with desktop computer a desktop computer or desktop pc is designed to stay on a desk or table so where we have to set up of our desktop basically we have to set up our desktop or pc in a desk or a table they usually consist of a CPU, monitor, keyboard, and mouse. So the parts of a desktop computer are CPU, monitor, keyboard, and mouse. It is also called personal computer. Students, mark this line. The desktop computer is called as personal computer here you can see the picture of a desktop computer you can see there is a monitor a cpu keyboard and mouse these are the parts of desktop computer pc can be defined as a small relatively inexpensive computer designed for an individual user so a PC, uh, we can define it as a small and inexpensive and it is used for individual user. At home, the most popular use for personal computer is playing games and surfing the internet. So basically, desktop computer is used at home for the purpose of playing games and surfing the internet. Now come to laptop computer. Laptop computer is also known as notebook. So also mark this line, laptop computer is also known as notebook. If I ask you what is the another name of laptop computer, you have to answer notebook is the another name of laptop computer. Laptop is a device which we can carry from one place to another. So here you can see the picture of laptop and it is very easy to carry anywhere from one place to another we can carry it easily laptop has a battery so that you can use it without electricity for two to three hours so in a laptop we can use battery and with this battery we can use our laptop for two to three hours without electricity laptops are usually less than three inches thick weight less than five pounds and can be powered by a battery so you can see it is so thick and less in weight and it is run to battery also now we will learn about pumped up computer here you can see the picture of pumped up computer a pumped up computer is a personal computer so what type of computer is pumped up computer it is a personal computer a small computer which fits on pump is known as pumped up so we can use this type of computer keeping in our pump pumped up is a lightweight small battery powered general purpose computer so the purpose of pumped up computer is it is lightweight it is small and it can run to battery and it is very easy to carry now students go to page number 11 here is a question for you do you know the parts of a computer connected to the computer are known as device. So the question arises, what is device? The parts of a computer connected to the computer are known as device. Now come to workstation. 
Workstation is a computer used for engineering applications, desktop publication, publishing, software development, etc. Such type of applications require a moderate amount of computing power and relatively high quality graphic capabilities. Here you can see this is the picture of Workstation. This is a kind of computer which is used for engineering applications, desktop publishing, software development, etc. You can see those types of computers at your home, at your school and also in offices. So where we can see this type of computer or workstation, we can see just such computer in our home, in our school and in various offices. Now come to the question, apply your knowledge which of the following is called notebook. We know which of the following is called notebook. Here are the options, laptop, pump top, workstation. So come to here, students, page number 10. In laptop computer, we find the answer. Laptop computer is also known as notebook. So you can easily find out the answer. Which of the following is called notebook? It would be laptop. So you have to put tick mark here. Laptop is the correct answer because it is called notebook. Now students, we will do some question answer. Students, you know, in our first class, we have done short question one and today we will do number two and three. Question number two is what computer can do? The question is what computer can do? The answer is computer can do many things such as number one, it reduces the time and warn us of spelling mistakes. Number two, it helps to work out large calculation in a fraction of a second. Number three, it does not get tired like human being. Number four, we can listen music or play games. Now come to question number three. Write about a laptop computer. I'm repeating the question is write about a laptop computer. And here is the answer. Laptop computer is known as notebook. It is a device which we can carry from one place to another. It has a battery so that we can use it without electricity for 2 to 3 hours. Laptops are usually less than 3 inches thick, weight less than 5 pounds. Students, that's for today. Question 2 and 3. You have to learn these questions at home. Now, it's time to provide your homework. Your homework will be short question. Two. I'm repeating, your homework will be short question 2, what computer can do. Students, I hope you have understood today's topic. Please do your homework and don't forget to submit your homework copies. That's all for today. See you in our next class, inshallah. Till then, Allah Hafiz. Assalamu alaikum.